Ryan Raphael. First time that like password thing took a long time to pop up. Mm. Well, this time. Like Im basically immediately. Oh well, the crash happened like shortly before I actually went to the rest thing. So one moment. Yeah. You'll still have all your like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Already have mine. I was already moving. Stuff. Times. Like if you were, does it like you know if you were I, I know you don't die but if you were to get in the car go to the gas station does that sound about right? Um, for diesel in a three hundred gallon truck, four twenty eight sounds normal. Right near Mount Shasta, which it's would be six, roughly six, about where we are. Cheaper. Actually, okay, right where we're in Sacramento right now, actually. So you should ask Sacramento. I, I, I'm not that concerned. Like you know, four sixty nine is like you know, at least in the general area, right? Is it within a yeah. hundred of miles? Because that's general area to me. <laughs> Taylor, so it's fine. I don't care enough. I'm back on the road. Yeah, we've, we've got like 125 bucks so far. Also, we're going to be heading ta through uh, Sa Sacramento interchange pretty soon here, and uh, that is always... Wait, what? I like how I got a red light violation when there was, it was a red and a green light. Your fucking light's you, here. The turning light was red. How you am I were, supposed you to tell that? went on a red turning light. I also have it on low graphics, so maybe the one on the left is easy most to see. is the left turning light. I really couldn't tell because it was like two pixels. You're able to you're able to tell by the position of where the light is. That's not how Wisconsin lights are. They're, the the lights are on top of each other. Ah. Uh. So basically, the leftmost the light will be. Lane light. I gotta pay a lot more close attention. If it has a turning lane light. We forgot to check the fucking mirror. Oh well. Yeah. Also, if you're able to, uh. If you're able to see them, it. The turning lane one should have an arrow instead of a circle. I don't like, think. I, I, well, I don't know if we have the, one yet, but I don't think we have enough pixels. Especially on low. I imagine I can yeah. turn it up. For me, it was just like, uh, it was like two lines. For I mean, me, it was two lines. I there mean, was a line along the middle and then one up, up vertical. Okay. A line on the left side was what I saw. I imagine so, I could turn it well, up. Well, we're bit. getting near Sacramento. I imagine I could turn the graphics up a little yeah, too, but I'm not too worried about it. Yeah. Um... So, we're near San to Sacramento Interchange. What Sacramento the Interchange so is normally Taylor, a traffic ridden hellhole. Are, are there other people in this world? Is it just what? me and you? Just me and you. So, the truck driving in front of me is normal? He's driving like a madman. Yes, also, you missed your turn off. It didn't. I didn't have a turn off. <laughs> Mine told me to go straight. Are you not going to San Rafael? 
I have 83 miles. I have 67. I'm going on the 80. I, I guess I'll see you when You I probably see have it. to turn around. Yes. So, as I was saying earlier, welcome to Sacramento Interchange. That's always how it goes. <laughs> Sacramento discovered. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I, I think the game just didn't, like, give me a fucking thing, because it's going to have me take a right. Like yeah, I think it's having to turn back Yeah, around. I'm getting off. I'm going to Sacramento. Oof. So I don't know if you want to, uh, let me How many miles do you have left? 72. I don't know if you've seen a yeah, Sacramento you... rest stop. Or if you, I don't even know if no. it matters if you wait for me at this point, but I'm getting corrected. Okay. It's up to you to do what you do. Yeah. So, one of the fun things about Sacramento Exchange is it has, like, really crazy lanes that will bring you somewhere you totally just do not expect. Like, it'll have two lanes that bring you in the same direction, but, the, but they're separate. And then there'll be two lanes that are together that then bring you to two completely different locations. I'm, I've pulled to the side for you. Okay. I'm waiting. I'll let you know when it puts me like back on that interstate or road or whatever. Yeah. Are you on an interstate? Are you on a highway road? What are you on? I'm on Highway 80. That doesn't know information. Is, is, it, is it an insert? It's, just it's an interstate. Radio. It's the X key for me. Yeah, the CB radio. Yep. yep. I, well, you can see me on the, the map, so you can literally see how close I'm getting. Oh, it's just having you go through Sacramento, avoiding the interchange again. Okay. Yeah, you'll be, like, coming on to almost directly behind me okay. once you get on the freeway. Alright. It allows you to change the music if you haven't. Or find music. Nice. Now, one thing I really dislike about this map, though, is the one is Country Road One Five Two. Okay. The One Fifty Two in this game is almost perfectly straight real and life very universe. flat. In real life, in real life, it is a mountain road. <laughs> I'm disappointed they don't have, like, you know, at least Chicago, like, you know. I would imagine they wouldn't have done just, like, one coast. Yeah. They would have done, like, you know, here's the East Coast, here's, the, you know, the Midwest, and here's, you know, you know. They've been working their way over. So far, they've gone over to Wyoming. I'm making a loop over to the interstate now. Also a mod that has the whole continental United States. Oh. Why didn't you say this when we were talking about it the other day? <laughs> because I'm not sure if it's been updated for a very long time. The last time I saw it was like a year or two ago. I mean, but it would give the general idea. <laughs> we could try seeing it to Cheyenne. <laughs> we can already drive to Cheyenne. I said Racine. Oh. That is Wisconsin. Yeah. Racine to Cheyenne. I thought you said Racine Cheyenne. Okay, I gotta wait for the lights to turn green. And at nighttime, I can see that there's two lights now. Yeah. Like, I can see that there is an arrow, so I may take it up one graphic setting. 
Because I don't think this game is even hard to run without a graphics card. If you're able to tell that it's not a circle, then you're good enough, because there's only ever that thing for left-hand turns. Like, if I turn my camera just a tiny bit to the right, I can tell, but if it's straight on, it's not visible at all. Okay. Okay, here you um, go. It turned green. I don't know how close I am to you, but... Oh, I can see your name. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Also, across the street, there's just a bus that's broken down. <laughs> On the other side. I didn't know we were in Chicago. Uh, when you get up to me, could you stop, like, just behind me? Because we're getting Sacramento to traffic now, so I'm going to need to be able to pull out in front of you. What? In order to be able to pull back in. Oh, so stop, uh, like, do I pull behind you, or do I, like, just stop? Yeah, just, like, whatever you're doing right now with right blinker, but stay in that lane. So I just stop in that lane right in front of you, or behind you? Okay, we're good. I'm oh. in. I put on my beacon so it's easy to see me. Because my speed's gonna be kind of inconsistent right now because I'm. Well, I literally have my fucking uh, cruise control set below 7 of the speed limit just because of the traffic. I got 36 miles. How far are you got? 32. Okay, so you're 3 miles ahead of me. In theory. I imagine it's not a one-to-one -one world because you know it would have took okay, a lot so longer. <laughs> in in towns, it's one-to-one -one and time is one-to-one. -one. Outside of towns, it's one to twenty, and the time is way wonky. Okay, it looks like one minute is about ten to fifteen seconds. Yeah. Okay, we're taking this turn off. I see. With a stop sign. Okay, uh, pull on the left side of this stop if you can. Just trust me on it. Even in cars, you kind of have to do that. What to make the turn? <laughs> Sometimes with those bridge ones. This this is Los Gatos. I'll pretend I know what you mean. Uh, the buildings to the side, I recognized an area of the town from travels. Oh, it's having a scan on the 580. This is another thing California does. It's instead of like getting on from an interstate to an interstate, you go from an interstate to some random ass side road to an interstate. That's really strange. <laughs> I made that turn and it took me a second. <laughs> nice. Uh, you're going to have to make it another one of those. All the fresh ingredients. And just like that, you're a chef. Get all the time for half the price. Just five ninety nine a month for select government assistance recipients. Learn more at Amazon.com. Yeah, so Martinez, Martinez Street is one of the common ones between 580 and 680. Um, for some reason, they don't have 680. They just have the 580, but then they kind of, like, flub to the 580 to kind of cover into where the 680 would cover. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, no, literally, to get from the 680 to the 580, there is just a random road through a town that's always clogged. <laughs> I am on the interstate. I have 11 miles. Okay, I know where you are. Um, oh, this is... Yeah, this is San Rafael. This this is definitely accurate. They have these really ass nine retainer walls and really ass nine corners at these intersections. What the big like fence wall? Yeah. 
Basically, anytime you see like the concrete barrier with that type of fence on it, uh, in that fashion, you're going to be in a bullshit town. We only have those on like our like high up bridges. Yeah, no, that tends to be where those are. But like and, the type of and bridge we all know, Taylor, have those. that's not stopping you from going over the edge if you're going fucking seventy. Yeah. To be honest, I think it's mostly for pedestrians. Do you have, like, sidewalks on your fucking interstates? No. <laughs> but those are not interstate ones. Those tend to be, like, a city's road oh. that goes over an interstate. But it also, it still doesn't have sidewalks. Got a good People song. are just fucking asshats. <laughs> what? Good song on the radio. I'm not even gonna bother. I am in a hurry. <laughs> Maybe a daytime, I'll try it. Okay. I have a skill point. Nice. Um. One second. Skills. Long distance is a good one to go into. Just in general. Um, but if between you sleeps. Huh? Is that like upgrading your sleep? No, that's the length, the like distance of uh, deliveries, and you get oh. higher rewards for higher ones. Like if you click onto it, you'll be able to see what the effects are. Fuel economy is the last one you want to upgrade. Okay, I will do long distance then. Because that just it makes your fuel last a tiny bit longer. I did long distance. The other ones actually affect your ability to get experience and currency and the jobs you get. Right, so any of the any of the other ones you could spend that first uh, points on, but long distance is always a good one to, to max out first. Where are we right uh, now? What happened? We are in San Rafael. I, yeah, I was saying, you ready for me to select another job? Uh, sure. We are at Yelland and San Rafael. Even though we're closer to Sacramento or Stockton. And Stockton is further north than it should be. It should be roughly about where Oakdale is, actually. I don't want to go to Reno. Holy shit, the map is actually... Oh my god. What? Like, I didn't... Like, all the states, they got a good amount of that. I imagine Mount yeah. Montana's next, just because of how the map is looking. Yep. Okay. So Montana and Texas. I think they're both... I imagine For some reason, you are now in Redding. I'm not anywhere. Oh, okay. Um, San Rafael? We'll do San Rafael. Okay. I don't know if it's gonna keep me where that or if it's gonna put okay. me back in Reading. Yeah, you're, you're back here. Um, before doing anything, though, I want you to look at your map because we are going to be crossing through this section of California. Um, so if you look south of us, you'll see Oakland. Yeah. And below that, you'll see, like, a really curvy, like, unlabeled road between the 101 and 5. With a rest stop on it? Yes. Yeah. Um, 152, just below that, is supposed to be worse than that. What? Like, 152 is supposed to be worse than that curviness? Yes. Interesting. It's supposed to be like mountain switchbacks that you physically cannot get a truck on. <laughs> At least on the left of the of the five. Towards the right of the five, well, it'd still be curvy, but you can get a truck on it. So between the city, like, where in California are you located on this map? Okay, so imagine the 152 went to the coast at its current okay. angle. By Santa Cruz? Yeah. So, okay. Alright. Where did the drive? Uh, one of the weird things about Santa, about Santa Cruz is, okay, so 